hello and what is going on everybody my name is all day obj here and today i'm bringing you guys a black ops 2 gameplay um this gameplay is going to be an 87 to uh 87 kills and i think two deaths here so pretty good gameplay could have definitely easily been a 100 plus um this is all solo too i think I, actually no i think i was playing with one friend but um could have easily been a 100 plus which kind of I was kind of raging at the end because I was hoping for to get the 100, and I died to kind of a, kind of a something that was really stupid, which is something that kind of you know bugs me about this game. There are a lot of ways to die, um, where you're just so unlucky, and this game I'd say a lot of it is about, um, just about your luck and not dying basically. Because to get a 100 isn't that hard as long as you don't die, but the thing is, it's pretty hard not to die. Um. But yeah, that's all about I have to say about that. It's just well, it's just pretty inconsistent with Black Ops 2. It's it's just so hard to stay alive because there's so many things that can kill you just randomly, and the only way to stop it is to be forced to use a, a perk, which is kind of something I don't enjoy about Black Ops 2. Is that there are some perks like you're forced to use. For example, um, flak jacket. Take that as an example. Same with like tack mask or things like that. And what I liked about MW3, you weren't forced to have to use Blast Shield or anything, because in Black Ops 2, if you don't have Flak Jacket, people are just going to be tossing C4s all over the place, and you won't be able to do anything about it. But in, you know, in MW3, for example, or, I don't know, in some other games, if they, like, in MW, yeah, in MW3, that's a perfect example, you didn't have to use Blast Shield, pretty much nobody did. I don't know anyone that would use Blast Shield. It wasn't a bad perk or anything. It was like Flak Jacket and Tack Mask combined into one, just a lot weaker. Um, but the explosives in MW3 weren't insanely overpowered, kind of like they are in this game. Like in this game, if someone throws a C4 over a wall randomly, you're guaranteed to die. Even with like a grenade, they're still ex extremely powerful, to say the least. And this is the Rise Shielder guy. He just comes up behind me. And if it wasn't for him, look at this. I'm like one or two off a of load star at this point. Definitely would have gotten it. This would have easily been a 100, maybe like 120 kills even. Um, but unfortunately, this guy just pops up and pops me with his uh, B23 yards. But as I said, this definitely could have been a 100. I just got unlucky. But, you know, that's that. Still a good gameplay. Hopefully, I can get some more 100s out. I'm trying to get them all solo, at least without support. Like, sometimes I'll be playing with a friend, but... My goal is to get all my, um, if I'm going to be posting 100s, I'm going to be trying to get them solo. And then, um, also, I joined the team All or Nothing. It's a competitive team for Black Ops 2 and, you know, well, just a competitive team in general, I guess. But right now, we're playing Black Ops 2 because, obviously, that's the most recent game, etc. Um, I really like the guys on the team. It's, so far, we're, we're doing really, really well. We've been scrimming a bunch of people, stuff like that, um... And if you followed me on Twitter, you'd probably know about that already. If you want to, it's twitter.com backslash alldayobj. Uh, just like my YouTube channel. And so, that's about all I have to say for, you know, the team thing. Um, and I'm definitely happy with my choice of joining them. They're all really good guys. You should definitely subscribe to all of their channels already. I'll just, um, I'll either, I'll just say them now. Um, I'll probably link them in the, the description, I'm not sure, but... Um, one of my teammates, Additions, YouTube.com backslash AditionYT. Another All or Nothing Vex. He is uh, YouTube.com backslash uh, X Captain Steel X with two T's. And then we have another guy. Um, his name is uh, well, his gamer tag is All or Nothing Illusion. And I'll, it's YouTube.com backslash I think Verify Illusion with a Z, something like that. I'll link it in the description for you guys. But definitely sub to all of those guys, because they're all really cool guys. They're really good at the game. And I just think overall, you know, they post... Actually, Illusion hasn't posted anything, but when he does, I'm sure it will be some pretty awesome stuff. So, definitely check out their channels um, in the description below. And as you can see right here in this gameplay, there were actually a couple of host migrations. I cut them all out, but... One thing, I think I definitely would have gotten 100 as well if the enemies didn't rage quit, which is a... Uh, Something that happens a lot, and you know you can't really blame them. If, if you're it, like, would you stay in the game if your enemies got a swarm? And the answer is for most people, probably not. 
so what en ends up happening in this game um, a number of times actually is that there are only like two to four people on the team um, for a decent chunk of this gameplay which you know less people less people to kill right but because as you can see at the end right here my swarms only getting me like a couple kills which is too bad but you know that's that the swarm sometimes if there are no enemies you know what can it kill but right here there were four but it still didn't really kill anybody but that's all right because i still did pretty well but as i said over and over again could have been 100 but still um i still did pretty beastly so it's all good in the hood but one thing i wanted to talk about as well besides obviously the gameplay is the new dlc camos i'm sure you guys have already know seen them at least i don't know if everyone has them but they're definitely worth downloading i'd say um aqua is one that i really like and the other one um can't remember the name but it's the red one stuff like that they're all pretty darn cool and i'd say definitely download at least those two i'm not the other ones don't look amazing coyote looks pretty good and the other ones um i don't know they're just there pack a punch i think could have been a lot better but it just looks really bland. I think they could have done a better job on the pack punch channel, but that's that. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay slash commentary. Please leave a rating. It really helps me out. Subscribe, like, all that good stuff, and adios.